Hello viewers, this is Chetan, Assistant Professor, Department of Mechanical Engineering, ADMEC. He is Mr. Uh, Dharnish, Instructor of the Measurements Lab. Today I will give the demonstration on uh, pressure gauge. The pressure, uh, before uh, going to the demonstration, we let us understand what you mean by pressure. Pressure is the load applied on unit area. So when we do apply a load on unit area, pressure will be developed and here we are calibrating the pressure applied on the instrument. So to, uh, next is the calibration of the pressure gauge, the experimentation is the calibration of the pressure gauge. In the calibration, we compare the pressure applied with the standards. Calibration is the comparing the measured unit with the standard unit. So the standards are provided by the vendor. This is called as the standard weight. And when we apply the load on the instrument, the pressure required to lift the load will be calibrated by using this instrument. So we can see over here, the initially the instrument is showing some value. We have not applied any load on this pan, so hence the instrument should show zero. So initially the instrument is not showing zero, zero, so hence we have to set the instrument for zero. Since the uh, instrument is very sensitive, the instrument has to be handled with care. Now the instrument has been set to zero. So once the instrument has been set to zero, we have to apply the load. Before applying the load, let us understand one thing. The pressure required to lift this pan, this pan is 0.5 kg and hydraulic unit is measured inside this instrument so that the hydraulic pressure will lift the load by applying the load on it. We can see over here we have the standard loads. So the pressure required to lift each standard weight is 2 kg. So I am placing this weights, this is 2 kg, so one more standard weight of 2 kg, the third standard weight of 2 kg, fourth one and standard weights of 1 kg each of two numbers is placed. The total load applied on the instrument is 10 kg and the pan weight is 0.5 kg calibrated weight. Now this we have to apply the hydraulic pressure and when the lift is, when the load is lifted we can say that the pressure is applied to lift the load. Now the knob will be rotated. Here we can see the pressure building, hydraulic pressure build to lift the load. The standard load applied is 10 kg per centimeter, 10 kg and the pan weight is 0.5 kg and the instrument weight should also be 10.5 the pressure required to lift the load should also be 10.5. You can see that the load is lifting. Now you can see that the load is lifted for 10.5. The value is varying, you can see over here, the value is varying. So since the load applied, standard load applied is 10.5, we have to calibrate to 10 point.
so we can see that the instrument is calibrated so the calibration procedure is first we have to set the instrument to zero we have to put the measure uh, standard weight once the standard weight has been placed the what is the standard weight as from that has been placed the same weight has, here the instrument has to show the same weight if it is not showing the same weight then we have to calibrate the instrument to the standard unit so the instrument is set for 10.5 so once the now we can say that the instrument is calibrated once the calibration is completed and one thing we have to understand the calibration has to be done for the maximum weight any instrument we have to calibrate for the maximum weight so we are releasing the hydraulic pressure created to lift the load so at the end of the uh, turning of the knob it should show zero as the instrument is calibrated so we can see that now the load is lifted out and the instrument is showing zero we have to check for each standard weight from now so we can say that the instrument is calibrated and we have to check for the each standard weight so i will take 2 kg calibrated weight and i'll place it over here on the pan and the total weight on this pan is now 2.5 because the measure the standard weight was 2 and the pan weight is 0.5 the total weight is 2.5 and we have to get 2.5 in the instrument the knob is rotated to build the hydraulic pressure we can see that the load is the pressure is building to lift the load this 2.2 so we can see that the load is lifted the load is lifted but the value showing here is 2.7 so an actual value of the weight should be 2.5 but it's showing 2.7 then we can say that the instrument is giving 0.2 kg per centimeter square as error so once we have to once we get this value we can note down the error so the measured the standard unit was 2.5 and the measured unit is 2.7 and the error is 0.2 so once the uh, value has been the uh, once the load is lifted the uh, and the value has been recorded the we have to unwound the knob so as to release the load and next to continue we have to put one more load which is i am placing another 2 kg calibrated load on this instrument and the process will be continued to lift the load so the total weight on this instrument is right now is 4.5 because i have placed two weights of 2 kg and the pan weight is 0.5 so the total weight is around 4.5 we can see that the load is lifted and the value showing on the instrument is 4.7 so once uh, we note down the values we can say that again 0.2 uh, kg per centimeter square of error is there unwound the knob to release the pressure and place the another 2 kg per cent 2 kg weight and the load is lifted so now the total weight is 7 The 6.5 kg and the load is lifted. We can see from this one.
and the calibrated weight is around again 6.7 so the error is 0.2 another 2 kg load has been placed and it has been raised to lift the load the total weight is 8.5 but the reading showing is 8.7 so again an error of 0.2 to 0.3 is there the final load of 2 kg which is in the form of 1 kg weights of 2 numbers is placed and finally it will be the total weight is 10.5 kg and the lifted load is 10.5 kg but the displayed load is 10.8 so hence the error is 0.3 so once the all the standard weights has been placed on the pan we have to we should not lift the weights as the pressure the oil, hydraulic pressure will be built so hence the safety precaution is we have to unbound completely we have to unbound completely to release the pressure and later finally the load has to be removed so again we can see that the instrument is showing zero as there is no load acting. So from this we can understand what is the error the instrument is showing when the standard weights are put on the instrument. Okay. Thank you friends.